Hey guys, Helen Hart Smith here from the Heart of the Witch's Path YouTube channel. I thought I would give you a little update on how spell work is going for Aries. So it's a little Aries update. Um, today, the day that I'm recording this is the new moon. So it's Monday the 27th of March 2017. And so I... Since it's the new moon coming out of that um, waxing or that waning period of the moon, and so I've been working magic to push away certain things, and I covered that in my main video, so I won't take you know take up time re-explaining that. But that work is moving along well, and with the new moon, of course, we I will be shifting my um, attention and into magic where I'm bringing to me. So that's kind of cool. Um, I haven't, the work that I've been doing, I haven't necessarily, um, I haven't noticed too many differences as far as the magic that I'm working. Although I will say that I treated myself to some chocolate today and it made me nauseous. So I don't know if that's, you know, part of the spell work or what, <laughs> but um, I'm not a super huge chocolate fan unless it's brownies and then that's a downfall. So um, I don't know. So we'll see. No big, um, no big noticeable things thus far. Everything is early, so we'll kind of go with it. Uh, but I'm feeling, I'm feeling motivated. So that's that's huge. I'm feeling like I'm making some strides in being aware and the roomie and I are being more aware of the foods that we're buying. We're vegetarian already, so we already eat fairly healthy, but of course there's still processed foods that, you know, we're looking at. And so we're uh, looking at eliminating those and bringing in more fresh, so or fresh and frozen vegetables, things like that. So that's that's a positive. We're both kind of on the same wavelength, even though I'm the one that's working this health magic and she's just being really supportive and all that good stuff. Uh, aside from that, as far as mundane work goes, we went back to the gym and I talked about that in the original Aries video. And so here we are a week later and we did make it to the gym three times last week. So I'm super stoked about that. Um, and then we plan on making it to the gym the same number of days this week. So uh, what I'm trying to do there is I'm trying to be like really vocal about it on my personal social media and stuff like that because I, for me... If I am sharing what I'm doing, then it helps me to stay accountable. So if I say, hey, we're going back to the gym and, you know, that, you know, hey, we're going back to the gym. Oh, we went to the gym. Then that helps me to stay motivated. And people, you know, if, if I have people say, hey, how's the gym going? Then that that makes me feel like I want to keep it up more. So that's that's pretty big. Um, because I'm an Aries and I'm a little temperamental and weird about, you know, stuff. So it's fine. So yeah, so doing that. So that's like the mundane stuff. Um, I do have the name of a doctor that I haven't called yet. I know that the doctor is kind of like the next mundane step that I want to take, uh, get probably a physical and, and take a look at some things. So, um, I'm nervous about going to a doctor. So um, I'm trying not to push myself too far out of my comfort zone. But yet again, I need to push myself out of the comfort zone. So um, maybe if you guys ask me if I call the doctor, maybe then that will help me to, to actually do it. So, you know, help me. <laughs> I would appreciate it. So yeah, that's it. Um, that's it for the update for now. Um, we'll see how the next two weeks go when we shift 
the the warrior aspect of Aries and that kind of magic. And we'll see where it goes. See, you know, we're taking control with the next two weeks and, and really channeling that that warrior um, aspect and really kind of taking the situation um, in hand and saying, OK, this is how I want my life to be. And this is how I want, you know, I want to be healthy. I want to have that health be a part of my life, I, you know, because there's the longevity there and things like that. So, and I'm babbling. So I'm just going to wrap it up right now. <laughs> Sorry about that, guys. Um, so yes, please comment if you enjoyed this video. I really want to know if anybody out there is working this magic with me or inspired to look at working magic like this. I think that long-term spell work really has a place in a practice. And I'm speaking from experience. I'm speaking from some, from a place of being someone that primarily worked instant magic, if I worked magic at all. And so, um, not that I didn't do longer spell work, but it just wasn't something that was really on my radar. And so I think that in a situation like this, where you're taking in hand a big goal, like reclaiming your health, long-term spell work, it's where it's at. So if you're doing something like that, then I'd like to hear about it. I'd like to hear about your results, things like that. So please comment or feel free to email me at the heart of the witches path at yahoo.com email. That link will be in the description box. Uh, if you haven't done so already, please subscribe to the channel. We'd love to have you come back time and time again. And that's it. So thanks for walking the path for a little while with me. And until next time, blessed be.